Hey Nomads! Hi. Today we are going to film an update video. We realized it's been quite a long time since we've filmed one of these videos. Yeah, so we just wanted to let you guys know what's happening with our channel and also about some upcoming travel plans. So first let's talk about our channel. You may have noticed that we've been more active around here the last few months and I think it was about a year and a half ago, I, I want to so. say, yeah. that we opened up a second channel that was for Japan videos only. Since we're based in Japan, we thought that that might be uh, useful for you guys to have a place to go to see Japan videos and then a channel, this channel, to see world travel videos. Mm -hmm. uh, but actually, it seems like it hasn't really been that. I guess useful in spreading out the content over two different channels and mm -hmm. honestly it's been really hard to try to maintain two different channels at the same time mm -hmm. so we have decided just to bring everything back onto this channel mm -hmm. um, so that we can give you regular content every single week we're going to keep that channel open for now mm -hmm. uh, we think there's still some useful content there for people who you know want to come to Japan or are interested in life in Japan so we're gonna, just going to keep it up there for anyone who wants to view those videos and we'll put a link to it in the description box if you're interested in checking it out right. and we want to thank everyone who went over there and subscribed and supported us over there we really really do appreciate it uh, we hope that though this move back here will mean more content for you guys more regular content for you guys uh, and we're actually now posting on a schedule. So we're going to be posting every Sunday. Um, so please come back on Sundays to see some new videos. That's right. And you never know, we may at a later stage revive the other channel. But in the meantime, this is where you'll find it. Yeah. So next we wanted to talk about our upcoming travel plans. We've got yes. a big October coming up. It's very exciting. Yeah. So we just wanted to let you guys know what we're getting up to so you can follow along if you would like to. Um, we are going to Niigata this weekend. Yay! For a camping experience. Yes. And like we love camping um, and we go, we go camping quite a lot. And we're actually really excited to show you guys this experience. We'll be working with like a, an outdoors like lifestyle brand and we'll be going to a camping grounds uh, in the Niigata area mm -hmm. and we're told it's not glamping or luxury camping or anything like that but it's more like you know a regular camping experience but a more convenient style of camping experience right. so we don't have to drag all our camping gear around right. uh, lugging them onto trains and uh, buses and whatnot so right. everything will be provided for us and yeah. uh, it sounds pretty <laughs> Good. Yeah, so they provide the tents and the equipment and they also provide food as well. Mm -hmm. So we're really uh, excited to share this experience with you guys. You know, we advocate camping a lot, but we understand that, you know, as a traveler coming to Japan for a short time, you probably won't have, you know, camping equipment with you or it's a little bit of a hassle to organize all of these things on your own in a foreign country. Mm -hmm. So, um, you know, we think that this experience would be really great for those of you who want to have an outdoorsy camping experience in Japan, but don't want the hassle of having to organize your own equipment. Mm -hmm. So we're, we're really excited to show you guys that. So in addition to that, we're actually um, heading up a day earlier to uh, check out and see what else is around Niigata. It's been, mm -hmm. It's been what seven, six, six years since we last went to Niigata. Yeah, I uh, think and it coincidentally, we also camped at that we time did, as yeah. well. We did, yeah, we did. But we didn't spend so much time there, so we've decided to go up a little early to explore and see what Niigata, Niigata has to offer. Mm. We'll be probably posting a few things um, on our social media, mm. so if you guys are interested in seeing what we end up getting up to, we'll post a link to our Facebook page as well as our Twitter account in the description box. Then the weekend after that on the 9th of October, mm -hmm. um, which is a public holiday, which is a public holiday, yeah, for National Health and Sports mm -hmm. Day, uh, we'll be hosting our next Instameet. So uh, for those who don't know what that is or what we do, we are the Instameet division managers for Instagrammers Japan. And essentially what we do is we organize Instameets or essentially meetups or photo walks, photo events mm -hmm. on their behalf on a monthly basis. Basically it's a way for people to come together, make new friends from all around the world, Japanese people, expats, people who are passing through on their mm -hmm. holidays in Japan. And we go somewhere new every month um, and we try to make it a place that maybe 
people haven't been to before mm -hmm. or we try to look at it from a different perspective or in a different light so we can discover new things uh, about the city. Uh, we mostly do the events in Tokyo because mm -hmm. that's where we live or you know somewhere around the Tokyo area. Uh, but sometimes we do them in other cities around Japan. Mm -hmm. um, but yeah, if you're interested, if you're in Japan or if you're planning on coming to Japan and are looking for you know, some activity or event to get involved in, mm -hmm. um, you can always, always feel free to come and join our events. Yeah, just contact us and yeah. the events are totally free. Jess hasn't already mentioned that. Mm. And uh, come meet some people. So yeah, absolutely. Very fun. And you can get those details on our Facebook page as well. If you just click on the events tab, um, you can find uh, the information about the next event there. So come join us if you can. Yeah. And as if October wasn't busy enough, uh, the following week we'll be heading to one of Tokyo's uh, many islands, mm. tropical islands, Hachijojima, and which aren't so well known. Yeah. So we'll be there for five days. Two of which will be attending a photography workshop uh, with uh, being hosted by Tamashima uh, Tourism, who uh, are responsible for uh, promoting the forest national parks and uh, the islands mm. around Tokyo. Mm. So that'll be very exciting. Yeah, right? looking forward to that. Mm -hmm. We've been wanting to go to um, the Tokyo Islands for a really long time, mm -hmm. um, so we're really excited to finally get there. Yeah. And we'll also be camping. Yeah, yeah. camping yeah. again. So, so yeah. this time we'll be bringing our own gear, Yeah. Um, which will be very fun. We haven't used our tent, uh, this new tent yet, so hopefully everything goes okay. Yeah. Uh, hopefully we haven't lost any bits and pieces, but it should be fun. Yeah, absolutely. Right? So there'll be a lot of hiking mm. that, uh, happening, um, beautiful beaches, lots of photography work, and... Uh, mm. Volcanoes. Oh yes, and yeah. volcanoes. <laughs> right. Yeah, uh, that be should be really interesting. Climbing volcanoes, hopefully. I don't think they're, it's currently active, but uh, we'll find out. That's basically it for what we're doing in October. We just wanted to let you guys know what we're getting up to because we'll be posting, you know, a lot about this stuff on our social media and things like that. Mm -hmm. So, um, you know, we'd love to see you guys over there so we can have, um, you know, we can chat about things that are going on during the trip. That would be really fantastic to see you guys there. And uh, thanks so much for watching and your support of this channel and our other channel and all of the changes that we've been making. We really, really appreciate it. And we hope to see you guys soon. Thanks for watching. Bye. All right, so just because Jess has been working so hard on these videos, I recently got uh, figured that uh, Jess needed a gift. So just wait right there Thank and you. get the box. Yeah, the, this we I I knew that something was going on because <sighs> we've John. been getting you know a lot of uh, deliveries, deliveries to the house, and he has been you know, like not telling me what, what he's been buying yeah. and tinkering in the front room. What is it? So I, I'm i not sure what's inside, but I'm excited. Did you open it? Yeah, there thank you. Very good. Let's see what's inside. This is so exciting. You look nervous. Can I cuddle on here? It should be. Oh, <laughs> should be okay. Let's see. Lots of hats. Whoa! What? It's actually a camera? Yep. Oh my goodness. I, I had a sneaking suspicion about the, the mic, but a camera, look! So exciting! Fantastic! Okay. Thank you. Not a problem, darling. I'm so excited to use this. You know, it's like as you start making more and more videos, um, you know, you start like progressing and getting better and better. And I'm I'm really excited to try to make kind of better and more interesting videos for you guys. So this will be really really helpful. Right. I have a really good camera. Yay! And I'm really looking forward to this mic a lot because sometimes I get frustrated as I know when the sound isn't quite as I'd like it to be. Yeah. Has a dead cat and everything. And yeah, that'll stop the, a lot of the annoying wind noise yeah. in, in our outdoor videos. Yeah, that's that's a real difficulty the wind noise so 
I'm really excited to use this. And hopefully you guys will see, will notice the quality in upcoming videos. So I guess we'll be taking this to uh, Niigata and to uh, Hachijojima. Mm -hmm. uh, I'll be testing it out. So hopefully you guys will notice uh, the difference in quality. That's okay. So excited. All right, guys, I guess that is really goodbye for this video. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time. Bye. Bye.